Hey YouTube, Gallagher123123 back with another Brown Note Touch video. In August, I did a video called What's On My Brown Note Touch, and it was a pretty popular one, so I've decided that I will go ahead and do these every so often so you get to see what apps I've kept, what I've uninstalled, just so you get an idea of the stuff that works with the touch. And then we will also in this video cover how you can uninstall an app that you are no longer using. So let's get into it. I'm going to unlock the touch. Go ahead and unlock and hit enter. Now I am using the keyboard just because it's easier to do this one handed using the Braille, the physical keyboard. So I'm gonna press A now to go to all applications. all applications. I'm using the British Eloquence voice at the moment. I've switched, I was using Heather before, but I switched over. Main menu all apps, accessible memory pro. So I've hit enter and I said main menu all apps and put us on the first app, which is accessible memory pro. This is a pretty fun, addicting memory game which I will show you in a future video. Adam, Adam text-to-speech, TTS. This is the Adam Sarah Proc voice you can get for your device. Amazon Music. Amazon Music is an app I have not had too much success with yet. However, I do want to keep playing with that. Amazon Shopping. Amazon Shopping. This is an app that has been made much more accessible in 3.0 because of the enhanced web support, web view support. ASR. ASR, that's my recording app. I'm not sure if that was on here before. Bard Mobile. Bard Mobile, which is the NLS app for playing NLS talking books. Braille Terminal. Braille Terminal, showed you that was there before. And in, introduced in 2.0. That allows you to cook up, you know, your iPhone to be so you can use the Braille Note Touch as a Braille display. Caitlin TTS. Caitlin TTS, another Sarah Proc voice. This is an Irish female. Canada. Now, I don't recommend Sarah Proc voices for daily use, and I'll show you in another video because they lag quite a bit. Camera. Calendar and camera, Google stock apps. Chrome. Clock. Chrome clock. Dice World. Dice World, those are fun games to play. You can play with other people. Docs. Docs. Downloads. Downloads. Like it's a Google like download list. Drive. Google Drive. Dropbox. Dropbox. TTS. E Speak. Text to Speech. I can also show you that in another video. ETI Eloquence TTS. ETI Eloquence. So we're currently using that, but I'm using the British language option just because you know it sounds different and you don't hear it often. Facebook. Facebook, of course, we have to have Facebook. Gallery. Gallery. Gmail. Gmail. These are just standard apps. Go read. Go read. That's Bookshare's downloading app and reading app. Google. The Google app. Google settings. Google settings. I never understood what that was for. Google Plus. Google Plus. Hangouts. Hangouts. Heather TTS. Heather TTS. Not to be confused with Acapella Heather. This is another Sarah Proc voice. They're Scottish female. Catherine, TTS. Catherine, that's another Sarah Proc voice. It's their US female. Keep. Google Keep. Key BRF. Now here are all the Keysoft apps. Key BRF. Key Calc. Key Calc. Key Files. Key List. Key Mail. Key Math. Now Key Math, that's new. Um, you can also access that through word processor. I'll demo that in a future video. Key Plan. Key Plan. Key Updater. Key updater, where you can get your firmware updates. Key web. Key web. Key word. Keyword. Kingdoms. Trivia Crack Kingdoms. It's always fun to play. KNFB Reader. KNFB Reader comes pre-installed now. Maps. Google Maps. Messenger. Messenger. My homework. My homework. This is an app I like a lot because it's an app where I can put down my homework assignments and. It works also very well with iOS. 
I'll show that. That would be the third party app for me to demo. Photos. Photos. Playbooks. Playbooks. Play games. Play movies and TV. Play music. Play news stand. Play store. Those are just your pl Google Play apps. Just showing these right here. Podcast Republic. Podcast Republic. I haven't experimented with this one yet. It's a podcatcher. Quiz up. Quiz up. It's a game which I also haven't experimented with. Settings. Settings. Sheets. Sheets. Shipwreck. Shipwreck, which is a package tracker I like. Simple weather alert. Simple weather alert. This is cool. It's an app to get weather alerts with, as it sounds. I think they also have a pro version, but I haven't looked for it yet. Skype. Skype. That works now. Beautifully. Slides. Google Slides. Spotify. Spotify. Another app that works quite well for listening to music. TD Bank. US. TD Bank. I, that I can use to look at my bank account information. Trivia Crack. Trivia Crack. Tune in Radio. A fun game. Tune in Radio works well. Tweetings. Tweetings. Twitter. Twitter. I haven't tried this. A Michael Map. You know Code Map. User Guide. User Guide. Victor Reader. Victor Reader. Vocalizer Voices. Vocalizer Voices for the Vocalizer Text to Speech. Voice Search. Voice Search. YouTube. YouTube. Jenny Voice. English US. The. Um. A voice, another text to speech voice I have. Which voice? English. And then I have a witch voice. So that's a lot of cool stuff. I think that's it. Bottom. Speech on. Stop recording video. Cap S. Take picture. Button. Six minutes. 54 seconds. Speech off. Okay, sorry about that. Alright, so let's go ahead and show you how to uninstall an app. I'm just gonna go through my list again. Accessible memory pro, Atom TT, Amazon Music, Amazon JSR, Bard Mobile, Rail Cafe TTS. Okay, let's Amazon, see. Camera, Pro, Lock, Dice World, Docs, Downloads, Live, Dropbox, SBI, TTS, ETI, Eloqua, Facebook, Gallery, Gmail, Go Read, Google, Google Set, Google Plus, Hangout, Header TTS, Hacker in TTS, Keep, TPRM, PK, Files, T-List, T-Mail, T-Map, T-Plan, T-Updater, T-Web, T-Word, Kingdoms, KNFD Reader, Maps, Messenger, My Work, Photos, Play Books, Play Game, Play Movies and Play Music, Play New Play Store, Podcast Reply, Quiz Up. Let's say we want to uninstall Quiz Up, which I will because I don't think I'm ever going to try it. Um, what you do is you go to your contacts menu. There are two ways to do it. You can press the menu key. Or you can do space with them. In most cases, I use space with them. But just to make it faster, I'm going to hit the menu key. Which is near where the thumb keys are. Context menu. Open app info. Now it's a context menu. Open app info. General device info. And then there's general device info. We want open app info. Open app info. Top. So I can go ahead and press a router key or enter. I'll hit enter. And now if we type the letter U, it's at app info, so if we hit the letter U, I'll attempt. Uninstall button. There's the uninstall button. So we will go ahead and press enter on this. Uninstall app. And now it's saying uninstall app, press the, I'll press my next thumb key. Quizzle. It says the app title. Do you want to uninstall this app? It's asking if we want to install this app, so let's see what our choices are. Cancel button. Cancel. Okay button. Okay, I'm going to select OK because I do in fact want to get rid of this, so hit enter. Uninstall app. Uninstall finished. Main menu all apps. Settings. So there it go. It's uninstalled. Now let's just do one more. Let's see. Install that Twitter app. TD Bank. Distributor Crack. Tune Radio. Tweetings. Twitter. Alright, so let's do the same thing. Context menu. Context menu. Open app info. Select open app info. App info. And we'll press U. Ooh, wait. App info. Navigate okay. up. Press U. Uninstall button. Select uninstall. Uninstall app. Now we can hit O for OK. OK button. Hit enter. Uninstall app. Uninstall finished. And there Main we go. Main menu all apps. Unlike those main menu. Contacts. Key list. 
I'm just going to lock my, I went back to the main menu with my back key. Or to the triangle shape button. The menu is a square button. So there are three buttons ne next to each other. And now that we're at the main menu, I'm just going to lock my device. Screenable. And there we go. That's what I currently have on the touch. And also how you uninstall an app. So I hope you found this video useful, and I'll see you in the next video.